Hello there everybody and welcome to Tarot by Isabella. I hope you're all doing great even if we live in quite troubling times at the moment. Today's video will be a prediction video for the country of Poland. And as you know Poland uh, has its border to Ukraine and they have received a lot of refugees and uh, last week even um, nice bombs from Ukraine as thank you and Ukraine was saying it was Russian but finally it showed it was theirs and a lot of people are beginning to boil they're beginning to get angry in Poland what is going on and I'm gonna look into what will happen in Poland now for three months to come that will say December 2022 January and February 2023 so three months ahead and to do so I'm gonna use my crystal ball my tarot cards and my oracle cards and this crystal ball it's a quartz crystal ball and quartz crystals are quite good conductors of energy electricity and they are used in uh, in a lot of electronic devices this material and in this case, in the spiritual case, uh, the crystal ball is going to send energy to me. I will be the receiver and when it arrives, it can manifest as something I see. Pictures, symbols, short clips could be something I see in the crystal ball or something I see like in the third eye, with the third eye could also be something I hear, smell, taste or feel. Whatever comes to me I will tell you and uh, we'll see what the other dimensions have to say to us about the country of Poland. And there are a lot of Polish people all around the world, not only in Poland, there live a lot of Polish people also here in Scandinavia in the United States and in many many countries so whatever happens in Poland it most affects them in one way or another especially if you have relatives and family still in Poland well, but before we begin I need to concentrate a little bit on my crystal ball and ask the powers to be with us and help to get good information, accurate information about what will, what is and what will be going on in the country of Poland. So I just need a moment to concentrate. And I just need my glasses on a little bit to see if I can begin to catch any information here. Poland. Mm. Uh, Polish people are quite passionate. They have a lot of uh, love for the country and they are getting fed up um, it looks like it will be many discussions here uh, back and forward if they still have to be in the NATO and e EU a uh, lot of voices will be uh, risen uh, they will raise their voices against uh, both NATO and EU EU. They don't want to be there anymore. Um, it's like the, the Polish people beginning to have enough. It will not end with this bombing 
this bomb from Ukraine like last week something else will happen there uh, could be some kind of even terrorist attack and blamed on on Russia but they will catch those who, who do it some kind of other explosion but in not in the border but in um, uh, somewhere in the center of the country It could be a, a, a small, not a big, big scandal, a smaller scandal around water. Some uh, water pollution in, in a city when people get sick. Not like very deadly sick, but still sick. And, and it will be also a scandal someone wants to save money or take money for themselves, some corruption. And they will catch those persons. There will be more people on the streets demonstrating uh, also in Poland. Uh, mainly young people, but also elderly people will join them. Um, they are quite upset. Uh, some major, um, could be journalists or owners of big media stations are going down. Mm. And during a period here could be people will seek a little bit like refugee in the countryside. Those who have country houses or uh, relatives living in, on the countryside, they will like ask them to stay there for some time. But a lot of angry people. Um, many Polish people have a big resistance against uh, Russia since during the era of the Soviet Union there was an occupation in Poland and many suffered during that occupation. Yeah. And, well, times have changed. It's not the same as it was before. The Soviet Union doesn't exist. It's it's a different kind of concept today. They will try to um, how do you say? Call in a lot of Polish Polish soldiers. Uh, to fight something that is not for Poland. Um, could be the NATO, could be uh, some other strange agenda that they want to send those Polish soldiers uh, for their cause, not for Polish cause. <clears throat> and I see uh, many soldiers refusing, no, we don't do that. We will not go. This is not for us. We, when we fight, we fight for our country, not for a globalistic agenda. And so there will be a lot, a lot of uprising there too. I also see people gathering on the street 
singing and holding arms, celebrating something. It is in the southern parts of Poland where there are a lot of mountains and high mountains and there will be a lot of UFO sightings and people will post them on um, different social platforms. And two ministers on high position will disappear. I see empty chairs. Well, that was uh, what I can get from the crystal ball. Let's continue to the cards. We're going to take some cards on Poland here. Can we get some information on Poland? these I need also some oracle cards and some dices those are special dices they have um, pictures words or symbols on them when it comes a dice that is empty I take an extra one and throw this one until it comes something on it so let's see what they say here we have a pigeon peace pigeon a star a piggy bank and a warrior As I said before, the warriors, the soldiers, they want peace. They don't want to fight a war that is not theirs. And they're going to save themselves. So if they get order from NATO or from other instance that is not uh, for, for the Pol Polish people, it seems like they're going to save themselves. They will refuse. A lot of people are uh, waking up in Poland. Um, they're gonna talk, they're gonna spread the news, and more and more gonna wake up for every day. And as I said, also the UFO sightings here we have the star, so you're gonna be news about that too. It seems like old Polish tradition is coming. It's coming to life again. And people want to share them, want to uh, continue with them. They don't like that Vogue uh, old alphabet agenda. And they want to keep to uh, their roots. And that is not LBTQF, etc. We also have uh, the judgment and we have the devil on the judgment. And as I said in the ball, crystal ball, there will be some judgment. They're going to catch some criminals here in Poland too, some very corrupt people. And they will, bro be, they will be brought into justice. And there will be many occasions of a lot of celebrations in Poland. Um, 
and the border to Ukraine is gonna be closed. It will, they will not receive so many refugees as before. Uh, more likely more people will return to Ukraine. Uh, the war is soon coming to an end, very soon, so they can return. And with soon I mean about one, one and a half month maximum. Okay, some last words for Poland. Let's see if we can get some last words. Looks like some very famous female singer in Poland. She's gonna pass away suddenly and it will be confirmed that it is because of this. And um, that will also wake a lot of people up. I almost see television sets flying out from the windows. Yeah, some last words for Poland. be a big uprising in Poland and it will be and due to this and that a lot of people are getting sick sick are sick or dying and especially when the children will get very ill after this it will be it's so many angry people and they will like hunt doctors down the street mm. Because everyone, nobody wants to be sick or feel ill. And there are some cures coming, some good medicine, but still many cannot be saved. And they're gonna hunt medical personnel down. A lot, a lot of anger. Mm. And it uh, and it's especially going to wake them up when the children will begin to get ill. Yeah. Uh, guys, that was my reading slash prediction for Poland. And if you liked what you have seen and heard, please don't forget to press the like button, share button and subscription button. I want to thank you all for watching and hopefully we're going to see each other soon again. Bye bye.